Dude, do you not ever see it when it's parked outside of Chick-fil-A? All right. Are we live? <laughs> Surprise, mother truckers. Hi, guys, I uh, hope y'all are having a blessed day today. We got a little full body uh, hit workout for you today, okay? So, guys, your format for today is going to be uh, six exercises. All right, we're going to cycle through those six exercises uh, six times total. You're going to be going 30 seconds on, 10 seconds off. Uh, and then we have a little little core finisher for you at the end, all right? So Courtney is going to demo for us today. So guys, if you are at home and you want to start off with that jog in place, you can get some chicken wings going, or if you want to get some external rotations, you can. Our first exercise is going to be a shoulder tap push-up. So Courtney is going to be in that high plank position, right? She's going to tap a shoulder, tap a shoulder, drop down, push-up. Notice when she does a push-up, she keeps those elbows in nice and tight, 45 degrees. If you need to do this movement from your knees, you can, all right? Exercise number two is going to be a single leg glute bridge, okay, guys? Let's get 20 squats uh, going at home. We're going to have one foot either up in the air or you can cross it across the knee, but we are going for that extension here just like that, guys. The biggest thing when we're doing uh, a glute bridge from the ground is to make sure that you're not slowly pushing your body back. Notice Courtney's got a really big bend on the knee. She brings those hips up, holds it for a second at the top, and then she rotates down, all right? Exercise number three is going to be a high knee sprint. So this is where your cardio comes into play. High knees pumping both of those arms ear to pocket just like so. Speaking of high knees, guys, let's get uh, some high knees going at home, okay? And we can get 10 quad stretches after that, all right? Uh, exercise number four is going to be a pike push-up. So you are going uh, to do a push-up just like so. Okay, guys, this is a very shoulder intensive movement, all right? Uh, pike push-up, rocking horse push-up, whatever you want to call it, guys. Here's the deal, though. If you do have shoulder stuff going on at home, okay, we're just going to change that to a cobra push-up instead. Hit a little different variation with that push-up, all right? Exercise number five is going to be a prisoner lunge, okay? So guys, if we're at home, let's get those toe touches, obviously on opposite foot. We're gonna start on both knees, come up on one leg, two legs, in a squatted position. So notice she's always got tension on those legs, okay? If you want to advance the movement, you can get to the top and get a jump, go right back down. If you want to really advance the movement, Tim is gonna show you guys how we do a hip up from the ground, snap those hips through, land in that squatted position, and then you can get the jump to the top, okay? Last exercise day, guys, let's finish it off with 25 jumping jacks. We have a lateral two-step shuffle. So quick shuffle to the side, one, two, and then one, two back the other way. So quick one, two, quick one, two, uh, just like so, all right? And then we'll get your finisher going. So spread out in the house. Uh, if you got people with you, make sure you guys are dispersed evenly in the room. We are gonna get after it here. The man, the myth, the legend himself is gonna light up our 10-second countdown. And we're gonna go right into those shoulder tap push-ups, okay? So we're gonna be in that high plank position. Here we go, in five, in three, and in one. You don't have to be in a gym, man. You can be in your house, you can be in your bathroom, your bathtub, the roof, a field. You can be on a freaking boat for all I care, but we are gonna find a way to get after it, guys. Remember, we're in that high plank position. We tap the shoulder. Tap the shoulder, we do a push up like so. If you need to modify, you can break it down to your knees. Same thing, okay? If you need to advance it, okay, you can go with a one handed push up instead. You're down to three, two, one. Good, guys. Flip it over onto your back. We have a single leg glute bridge, okay? Guys, if you want to add some variance to this, all right? Every third rep, we can hold that for three seconds. Three, two, one. Let's work. Let's work. Come on, come on. Guys, when you walk down the street, people should literally call you the slot machine because if they bounce a quarter off that thing, it goes, ding, let's go. 15 seconds left in that set, already halfway through. Good, keep those hips up. No, we're rocking out once, we got six sets, it's even. We'll rock out one whole side of the set. You wanna hold that third rep for three seconds, if not, guys. If you need somebody to come by for emotional support, hold your friend hand and not break eye contact, we encourage it, three, two, one, Relax, guys. We got a high knee sprint, so let's hop up onto our feet. Okay, we're hitting your cardio. So we got the chest, the core, the glutes, the cardio. Three, two, one. High knee sprint. All out. All out. It's got to be full speed today. Come on. Come on. Look, guys, just look at the smiles on those faces. How happy we are about getting better here, man. Hopefully, you're happy at home getting better, too. 15 seconds left. Full out sprint Today, you are under your 10 second mark. Let's go. That's not where we start slowing down. It's not where we start going, my, my, my legs are burning. Keep going. You're down to three, two, 
And one. Good job. Relax, all right? Pike. Push-up. Rocking horse push-up. Or for those of you that have shoulder stuff going on, you can do a cobra push-up, all right? Uh, booty goes up in the air. Let's go. Good. So we are in that V position, going up the back of our legs, down our back. You are lowering your head towards the floor, guys. This is more of a vertical push-up to emphasize that delt more so than the chest, okay? Do not rock forward too fast and give yourself a concussion. You've got about 10 seconds to go here. Good. Keep it up nice and high. Awesome job. Lower your body all the way to the floor. And three, two, one. Rest right, guys. Good job. Okay, we got a prisoner lunge, right? So we're going to be down on two knees. Now, if you want to do the hip up, you can do the hip up. That's the one we snap the hips through. Or you can come up on one, two, jump to the top. Three, two, one. Make it happen. Okay, make it happen. Sometimes you just got to do what you got to do. Good. Get up as high as you can. Freaking snap that off. There we go. I love it. If you haven't tried it at home, well, your daggum better be. You got about 15 uh, seconds left here. Good. Snap it off. Hoo there we go. Get it on up. Don't forget to jump at the top. So important. Good. It's like a little cherry on the top of your gain Sunday. You got five. You got three, two, one. Relax, guys. Lateral two-step shuffle. Make sure you are spread out. Uh, if somebody does get in your way, you can little boy them to the ground. Three, two, one. Let's go. Let's go. Shuffle, shuffle quick. Shuffle, shuffle quick. Guys, it's a fast pace movement. We are working fast switch fibers here. We are working on explosive lateral movement. You need to be able to operate at any direction on any given plane. You got about 10 seconds left in this set. Guys, look, notice how they stay low. They stay low. That lets them be versatile. That lets them change direction quick, and it lets them stay lean as a mother trucker. Three, two, one. That's a rest break. So if you guys want to slow it down at home, take the time to really contemplate why you're doing this workout. Now, if you're doing this workout to stay average, mm, not the best idea. But if you're doing this workout to take it from a level of average to an absolute savage, you came to the right place. We got about 10 seconds. We're right back in, okay? We are on the ground, high plank position. We're starting with the shoulder tap push up. Let's go get it. Three, two, and one. Find a way to work it out. Find a way to work it out. Tap, tap. Get your uh, chest all the way to the ground here, guys. Go control that movement. Now, when we do the push-up, we're not just cutting the shaft to the elevator and falling to the floor quick. We close that down nice and slowly, that gap between your chest and the floor. We push all the way up to the top. You got close to five seconds, close to three seconds. And two, one, relax. Good job, y'all. All right, single leg glute bridge, let's go. Awesome job so far, but we are just getting heated up, baby. Three, two, one, let's go. Let's go, good, come on, come on, good. Your goal should always be to have the firmest peach on the beach, and guys, this is what it's all about. You don't need a ton of weight to be thick like a bowl of oatmeal. You don't need a ton of weight for some syrup on that buttermilk pancake if you get my drift. Y'all got 15 seconds to go here, working, through it. No one ever complained about a firm dang gluteus maximus. You got about five seconds to go. Good. Hold that third rep and three, two, one. Good job. Relax, right? We're going to go into a high knee sprint. So let's pop up on your feet, guys. Please make sure we are driving both of those arms ear to pocket. Ready, set, go. Okay. So guys, when we do this run, we're not chopping the hands. We're not rotating our arms in a circular fashion, okay? You are going from your ear, driving that elbow back like you're trying to elbow your younger sibling right into your pocket, don't say it. 15 seconds, here we go. Here we go, good, you're almost done. You're halfway through, we're not slowing down, we're not starting to give in, we're ain't no white flag waving, bonbon eating, couch sitting, excuse making, we get it done, three, two, one. Y'all got a pipe push up, okay? We're gonna be again in that V position, okay? As, as you move through this, if you need to modify, that's okay, all right? Three, two, one, good, let's go, let's go, good. You have a choice every single day. You can be Charmin Ultra Soft, or you can stay hard, mother trucker, but that's on you. Let's go, let's go. Rotate that head forward towards the ground, guys. Good, they're pushing up through those shoulders, all right? Just 
like so. Y'all got about 10 seconds left here. Come on, come on. The shoulders should be burning. We should be getting a lot of action out of that delt. And you're down to three, two, one. Relax, cut it. We got a prisoner lunge, okay? So, you can either step, step, hop, or you can snap it off. Up to you. Boom, let's go, come on. Don't delay the inevitable today. Don't delay the, the inevitable today. Okay, okay, sweet, sweet. Awesome, guys. All right, 15 seconds to go here, cool. All right, that's all right, here we go, here we go. Let's not, you know what, that's okay. Hey, if you wanna put an emphasis on the core, nothing wrong with it. But don't forget the top jump, you got seven seconds to go. You got five seconds to go, do not lose your pace, you're done. With the prisoner lunge, we also got a lateral shuffle, so we're gonna go side, side to side. All right, oh boy. Ready, set, here we go. Awesome, awesome. Good, guys, I love it. Shuffling side to side, good. Now guys, if you are using an excuse of, I wanna focus on a different muscle group here, okay? And you have a bachelor's of science, that makes sense. Cause that excuse is a load of bull. All right, here we go, under 10 seconds. Under, your last five. Your last three, two, one, five. All right, guys, good. Hop off, get some water. We're gonna take 10 seconds, all right? Now, during this time, I really want you guys to focus on bringing that breathing down, okay? Look, do we wanna go for a nice little cow burn here? Why, hell yes, we do. What we also wanna start to do, guys, we wanna make sure that we are maintaining that muscle mass while we're staying at home doing these workouts, right? So 15 seconds. Start thinking about ways, how can I progress this movement? How can I make it a little bit more difficult, okay? Maybe I do some active rest in between. Maybe I get some bicycle stuff I got going. All stuff you can do. Three, two, one. Shoulder tap, push up, let's go. Let's, gr let's go, let's grind, let's get it done here and now. Good, tap, tap, push up, okay? Guys, notice every time they're going down for this push up, all right? They're keeping those elbows in line. They're at 45 degrees, they're also lowering that chest right to those hands. So guys, if you're doing this push-up and your hands are way out in front of your chest, you're gonna start putting a lot of pressure on that elbow and that shoulder we don't need, okay? We got about three, two, one, relax, take a break, flip it over, we got a single leg glute bridge. All right, all right, good. Make sure you're getting full range of motion, do not pulse these reps out. Three, two, one, that's when things start to get real weird, real fast. You got about 20 seconds on the set, guys. It's gonna go by quick. We want that full extension, guys. Stretch those glutes all the way down the floor, then get that full snap to the top. Squeeze those glutes on that third rep, okay? 15 seconds to go. You're halfway through. Build that nice little pace in there. It's gotta be nonstop during that activity period, all right? We're gonna get ready to move to the high knee sprint in three, two, one. Relax, good job, up on your feet, let's go. Up on your feet, let's go. We'll get a pep in your step. You wanna start early, start early. Once you complete this round, we are halfway through. Three, two, one, bang, bang, let's go. Come on, come on. Build the hype zone up a little bit today, man. You should be screaming between sets because of how excited you are at getting better. Your neighbors should be looking through your window, man, what the hell is going on in there today? Oh, they're getting better, I'm about it. Y'all got about 15 seconds to go. Come on, come on. Keep those knees up in your chest. Look guys, as you start to fatigue, you see people doing these right here and they're like, at least it's better than nothing. I've, I've seen people do a lot of nothing, don't look that bad. Three, two, one. Wow. All right, we're on the ground again. Pike push up. V position. You want that butt way up in the air, like an awkward height. Ready, set, go. Oh, lower that head to the floor, guys. Awesome, notice. Every time they're going down, they're pushing that head straight in between their hands. They're coming right back up, all right? They're not shooting that head way out in front of their hands. They're not putting any weird tension on their back or any extra tension we don't need on the shoulder. They're just using those delts to push through the top of the movement, okay? We got about seven seconds to go. Good, bend those knees if you have to, that's okay. Three, two, and one. Relax, great job, great job, prisoner lunge. Oh boy. What's the matter, y'all tired? Tired. Tired, don't know, three, two, one, we don't get tired. We don't get tired, my God. Courtney's got six jobs, Lily's got two phones, and Tim's apparently an Instagram model, but they still don't get tired, baby! Woo! 
Woo, we do this every day, every day. Multitasking, multi-talented, hardcore mother truckers. Good, get you a little jump. Oh, get you a little, get you a little jump. Top. Hey guys, we're down about five seconds. Yo, good, fight through it. Fight through the finish line. No breaks, no rest until now. Relax. Lateral, two-step shuffle. Here we go. Hopefully y'all ready, man. Got the little cow burn going. Three, two, one. We're in it. We're in it. Our bodies are warmed up, man. We're loose. We're feeling it. We got the right vibes today. You woke up with air in your lungs. What are you on? I was anticipating a winning. We're on a winning streak today, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Every day we hit two feet is a blessed dang day. Y'all got 10 seconds to go. Good, quicker shuffles, quicker shuffles. We're staying low here. Hopefully y'all staying low at home. You got about five, three, one. It's over. Already another round bites at us, okay? So guys, that is three rounds down, all right? This is essentially halftime, okay? Really start progressing here. This cannot be where we start taking reps off, quitting sets early. We got the finish line in sight. Three more rounds. One quick core finisher, and you are done. So, hop on out to the dance floor. Push up position, high plank. Let's knock them out. Tap, tap, boom, get that chest pump. In three, two, one, let's go, let's go guys. Gotta love Tuesday, gotta love Tuesday. International chest day, number two of four. Here we go. Good, every freaking day is chest day, baby. Let's go, baby. All the way down, guys, remember, if you need to drop to your knees to modify, okay, um, don't, all right? We're gonna find a way to finish all these sets how we start. No, if we need to drop to our knees and modify, guys, always, always focus on having that perfect form so we can work the muscle the way it's intended. Three, two, one, relax. Single leg glute bridge. On your back, booties go up, booty goes down. Drake's got a song about it. Three, two, one, let's go. 30 seconds. Get those hips up all the way. Remember, if we want to advance that a little bit, you can hold that third rep for three seconds just like so, okay? Get to the top, hold the squeeze, tight as you can. Awesome, like you're at your, your girlfriend or boyfriend's parents' house for the first time and they decided to make baked bean casserole, man. Squeeze those cheeks. Y'all got about five seconds. You got about three, two, and one. Hey. That's a great job, y'all. But what we're gonna do now is we're gonna hop up on our feet. We got a high knee sprint, okay? Let's go, let's go. Let it all out right here. Three, two, and one. It's all gotta come out on the dance floor right here and right now, guys. A high speed pursuit of excellence every single repetition. You're already down to 20 seconds to go. The pace is set in stone. They will not slow down. I'd be shocked if they didn't get extra this set. I'd be, I'd be I'd blow my mind. 10 seconds left, watch them, watch them, because they are absolute freaking savages. You guys got about five seconds left. If you want to stay mediocre, if you want to go next level, now you take your break. Good job, guys, I like it. We got pipe push-ups though. So, we're in that V position again. Booty's up in the air, but the gains are about to be real. Let's go, let's go. Awesome job, guys. Good, guys. Again, I can't emphasize enough how important it is, guys. Lowering your head right in between your hands, okay? If that head's going out of front, way in front of your hands, or if you're coming back too shallow, those are just not good positions. We want to put your shoulder in right between your hands, right back up to the top. You got about five seconds left here. Good. Let's finish these last few reps out. Good job. Lower it all the way down, and then three, two, one. Rest break time. First one lunges. We start on two knees, we finish on your feet, because that's just what champions do. Let's go, you get knocked down, you get back up. Bang, go get it. Okay, there in court, I like it, I like it. Snapping through the top of the movements, guys. This is an explosive movement. If we are doing that hip up, guys, and you need to advance it, you can put a small animal on your shoulders, uh, jump up as high as you possibly can. Good news is you only got 10 seconds left for this, okay? We're moving that lateral two-step shuffle, but make sure we are exploding. Every freaking rep, three, two, one, relax. Lateral two-step shuffle. Boom, boom, to the side. Boom, boom, to the side. And then you got what, two rounds left? Two rounds after this. Ready, set, go. Quickly, 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 they move. To the side and back, just like 
So, awesome job, okay? Guys, again, if somebody starts encroaching on your space and you need to RKO them out of nowhere, I get it, I get it. 15 seconds left in here, come on. Awesome job. I feel like I'm gonna look back at some point and be like, where's Tim? And Courtney's just gonna be like, who knows? Who knows? We got five seconds left here, come on. Finish it, finish it, do it right, and keep it tight. Three, two, one. All right, we have another water break. But as you're at this other water break, you're again at a crossroads, okay? As we pull up to this crossroad, I want you guys to think about this. Here's this nice, grassy, slightly paved, wide path. This is where all the average mother truckers go, okay? All the people that just like being comfortable in life, they don't really care if they get better as long as they're comfortable. Here's this narrow, freaking nitty gritty path with some ruthless mother truckers ready to get better. Which way are you going? Three, two, one, let's get it. Let's get it, come on, come on. Good, nice job. Tap, tap, all the way to the floor. All right, it might be story time at the end of the day, guys. We might have to do a little, little, little finisher where I get to tell them a, a story about a famous model, all right? We're down to about 10 seconds to go here, good. Remember, how you start is how we finish. You just hit. Last handful of seconds. Look at that. Three, two, one. It's done. It's done. Flip it on over onto your back, guys. Got that single leg blue bridge again. Okay, we only got two more rounds of this, all right? So we're going to do it this time. Run it through. Then you're on to your last round and the finisher, and you out. Three, two, one. Let's go. Again, guys, if you're more comfortable, that leg extended. Awesome. If you can feel a bigger contraction, you feel like you've got bigger, better range of motion by crossing that leg over, absolutely go for it, okay? Whichever one you think is gonna benefit the booty more today, okay? Let's go, good. It's all about the buns. So I need y'all to just work them for the last 10 seconds here, squeezing every third rep, regardless. Three, two, one. That's another rest for we are now moving to a high knee sprint. High knee sprint. Ready, set, go. Let's go get it. Let's go get it, guys. Awesome, awesome job, guys. You need to start to think about things, okay? What motivates me? What pushes me to the next level, okay? So when Courtney's doing her high knee sprint, she imagines herself in a crowd and somebody goes, does anybody here do CrossFit? Oh, here I go! If it's Lily, guys, and, and any clothing company says, we made this pair of joggers one size too, oh, here I go! When H&M has a sell on leopard printed Speedos, Tim is high knee in his way to that sale, baby. Three, two, one. It's all about it, day, guys. If you can't put a smile on your face while you're getting better, we gotta work on it. We're gonna be down, pike push up, V position, let's go. Good, shoulder intensive, stay motivated, stay inspired today as we finish these last handful of sets here, guys. Good, again, right down to in between your hands. Head goes right down to those hands. Lower it nice and slow, all the way to the ground. Guys, you really want to advance this. Start going down for a three second count. All that time and attention, and then pop up quick. Three, two, and one. We got a prisoner watch. Hopefully, you're just now warmed up. You're freaking raring and ready to go. Tired ain't on your mind, man. Three, two, one. Either snap it off. Look at that. Look at that. Smoking him today. Let's go. Good. Pop and then pop off the top just like that. Go rise to greatness today, guys. Here's the deal. If you have some at home, if you wanna try the hip up, guys, put your hands on the side of the couch, man. Use that to snap those hips through. There's nothing wrong with that. Do not forget to jump at the top. Don't you dare stay ordinary, not today. Y'all got three, two, one. Rest break time. We don't quit this early. And I know y'all don't either. We got a lateral two-step shovel. Get him, let's go. Quick to the side, quick to the side, then we're right back the other way. We hit it, and we're right back the other way. Let's go, let's go. Good, hit it and get it, y'all, all dang day. Keep it moving, keep your body in motion. No matter what, stay active, stay after it. You're approaching the last little bit of the set. Guys, you have one more round coming up. One more round, man, that gets me a little hype, man. It gets that electricity run through my veins, man. You got about three, two, and one. This is it. You made it. I'd be shocked if you didn't see this last round. Oh my God. I'd be shocked. 
All right, guys. 25 seconds. Here we go. We're taking it next level like an absolute savage. Starting with the shoulder tap push-up. Let's go. Let's get it. Everybody's going to be in that high plank position, okay? We got my asthma inhaler back. We got on set. We got it back. I might need a rip here in a second. All right, guys. We're going to start in five, okay? Next level like an absolute savage. Good. And here we go. We're going to tap. We're going to tap. We're going to push up, okay, guys? Now, look. If you need to slow those reps down, really focus on those muscle contractions. There's nothing wrong with that, okay? Nothing wrong with embracing that pump, okay? Good. Now, sometimes people, they fly through reps. Guys, life is too fast. I'm not gonna push through sets super fast. I'm gonna enjoy the reps. I'm gonna enjoy the sweat equity and the swag that oozes out of our pores and three, two, one, rest break time. All right, guys. We got a single leg glute bridge. Luckily, I get to do my right leg. So here we go. Cross it over, boom, pulse it up, okay? Guys, again, every time we do this exercise, think about ways I can advance the movement. Well, every time I speak, my core has to contract. It has to activate. So if I start giving sound effects like boom at the top, every time, boom, I get the extra core contraction. So now I'm working on my glute. I'm also, boom, working on my abs. Every time, mm, to the top, just like so. Find ways to get better today. Good. Oh boy, high knee spread. <laughs> Golly gee, how lucky are we? Here we go, three, two, and one. We're working today, baby. We're moving today. I'm in a constant state of motion here. It does not matter what gets thrown your way. See, sometimes people like to just put adversity right on your plate. Well, I say, you know what? I hope that plate is at Golden Corral and it's an all-you-can-eat buffet because I came here hungry. I came here ready for that next level. I'm also ready for that inhaler, Vic. So we got five, three, and one. Hey, good job, relax. We got a pipe push up. All right. Man, if I... If I feel half as good as y'all do right now, y'all must feel great. Fight push up, V stance. Here we go. Dropping that head right down and back up. Right down, right back up. You wanna slow that rep down. Also guys, never forget one of the most important parts of any arm exercise is never breaking eye contact with the muscle. If I want my delt to grow, I have to stare at it obnoxiously and all the time. If I walk by a mirror, I gotta pop a flex and relax. We're gonna have a good time today, baby. Prisoner lunges. Dear God, here we go. Sometimes the path ain't clear, so you gotta make your path. We're gonna go with the core activated one, just like this right here, okay? So we rise up to one leg, to the other leg. I'm in a squatted position. I get my little hop to the top, I'm back down. Now look, am I snapping it off? Maybe not. Am I in motion and getting better? Hell freaking yeah, baby. Good. All the way, guys. If you're not holding the squat, that's probably why you ain't thick with two C's. So, pop it to the top, bring it down nice and slow. Boom. Snap it off to finish. Thank you, Jesus. Here we go. Hey, last set, guys. Lateral two step shuffle. Here we go. Three, two, and one. Shuffle, shuffle and I'm back up the other way, guys. Good, this is it. This is the home stretch. Some people, man, they doubted you. They didn't think you'd make it this far. They didn't think you'd stay this consistent. They also ain't done a dead dumb thing over this break. You have, you stuck with it. You kept your eyes on the prize. You started busting the seams on that medium size T. And this is why you're a freaking champion. All right, guys, so, they are going to demonstrate the core finisher. Well, I try not to go on a cardiac arrest, but what we're gonna do guys to finish this off is we're gonna hold our feet at six inches for about 30 seconds. After that 30 seconds goes by, we're gonna roll up onto our keister. We're gonna do what's called a Cindy Crawford. While they do the Cindy Crawford, I'm gonna tell you the story as to why it's called a Cindy Crawford. So, Everybody's on their back at home. We're laying all the way down. Guys, if you have back issues, bend your knees. Tim will show you the mod. Keeps the knees bent just like so, okay? Just make sure if we do this, 
we're rolling those shoulder blades up to hit those top two bagel bites, all right? So on your back, 30 seconds is on my watch. Ready? And feet at six inches. Let's go, let's go. This is the finisher. Understand what a finisher means. There is nothing left. It has been completed. It is done. The tank is empty. I had nothing else to possibly offer because I am finished. But we're never actually really finished because we can always find a way to keep going. Good. You got about 15 seconds left here. Good. Guys, as soon, as soon as I start to wildly bark like a ravenous dog, you are going to go up into a seated stance and you're going to start driving those knees in and out of your chest, okay? It could be at any... <laughs> Let's go, right into it, right into it. Cindy Crawford's now. Some of you might be saying, why? Why does that name sound so familiar? I'm gonna tell you why. Cindy Crawford was a beautiful, she still is, beautiful model. And one day, back in her late 20s, she's driving her little cute model car down the back roads of California. She takes one turn, just, just a little, a little too sharp, just a little. Her car goes careening down the side into a lake. Guys, I cannot make this stuff up. She is drowning. Her car is submerging itself underwater. She cannot breathe underwater. Cindy has two options. So she thinks about it in her head. For a long time, she's thinking about it. And she's thinking about it. And she comes up with this idea. I've got two choices. I can die beautiful or I can get my mother truck and keister in that back seat and I can kick the windshield out and live to tell the tale. Some of y'all are drowning right now. Some of y'all are surviving. Let's go, y'all got 10 seconds left, all out. All out and you're done. All out, no breaks, no rest, all out. Siri, shut up, we're working. And we are freaking done. Guys, couldn't be more proud of you today. Awesome effort, hopefully. You guys are staying tuned. Hopefully you're subscribed. Guys, if you subscribe, I've got way more stories than that. Hit that like, hit that subscribe. Have a blessed day. And let's get two quick claps and a fam on three. Ready? One, two, three. Family.